Hey Juicers, did you know that one of the most famous old Hollywood actors was Anna Mae Wong? Anna Mae Wong was born in Los Angeles, California in January 1905 as the granddaughter of Chinese immigrants who had moved to the States in the 1850s. During the early years of her life, Anna Mae continually visited movie sets around the city and would often skip school to go to the local movie theater. And in 1919, she went to a casting unbeknownst to her parents and was cast to play an extra in the film The Red Lantern. In a matter of a few years, at the age of 17, Anna Mae Wong was cast in her first leading role in the 1922 film The Toll of the Sea. Despite Anna Mae having immeasurable talent, she faced constant discrimination in Hollywood and was institutionally barred from many roles, as laws at the time prevented the portrayal of interracial marriages on screen. Even when casted, Anna Mae was continually positioned to play stereotypical Asian roles. Due to a lack of roles, Wong moved to Europe and worked on a handful of films there before returning to the States in the 1930s. The show, The Gallery of Madame Liao Son, created in the 1950s, made Anna Mae the first Asian American lead in a US television show. At the age of 56, Anna Mae passed away, but her career and impact would carry on for generations. Anna Mae broke barriers by being the first Chinese American film star in Hollywood and achieved international recognition for her work in over 60 films in her tenure as an actress. Anna Mae won praise for her work and activism in and out of Hollywood from a variety of diverse communities and is continually recognized not only for paving the way for other actresses and actors of color, but for also showing the world that Asian American women can be successful professionals too. And that's the juice.